This is how much my six foot nine husband eats at McDonald's. To start out his first order, he of course got a Big Mac. He ate his first bite and confirmed that it was indeed a delicious burger. I'm surprised he didn't get a Happy Meal to go along with all the happy dancing he was doing this meal. He got that Big Mac as a combo meal so that he could have his fries and drink for the whole time. He wanted to get the collector's meal for the cool cup, but they were out at every McDonald's in the area. After downing a few fries, he moved over to his 40 piece McNuggets. He started out by eating 20 of those, broke it up with a few more fries, and then downed the other 20 with no problem. That food obviously didn't fill him up so he went back to put in his second order. While he was waiting for that food to come out he finished off the fries he had left. So much for having those for the entire meal. To start out his second order he got himself a McDouble. He really does make those things look so little. After eating that in like two bites he moved on to his McChicken. He of course got it without mayo and then added his own ranch to it because that's how the cool kids do it these days. He also added a little bit of the spicy buffalo sauce and after one bite had the epiphany that he just made a spicy McChicken sandwich. Unfortunately his IBS acted up a little bit so he ran off to the restroom. I was worried because this McDonald's has a 45 minute time limit and you know how long guys can take. But thankfully this McDonald's was really empty so they didn't kick us out. Right after he finished using the restroom he was ready to put in his third order. To start out his third order he had a filet of fish He just had to do it so he could have all three of the different meats in one sitting. And then by some miracle the ice cream machine was somehow not broken so he had a Kit Kat banana split McFlurry to finish off this episode of Super Size Me.